So now we are meeting the dogs more intimately. Uh, this is Roxy. She's a female of uh, 18 months. Uh, she's developed quite a bit. She's daughter of Arma, our import from uh, Bulgaria. Uh, she's our former breeding, so we keep from our stock. Uh, this was a litter of eight, four males, four females. She's lovely. We are looking forward to breeding her to a different male. And uh, it will be nice, most definitely. Well, uh, this one laying here is uh, Fatma. Uh, Fatma is uh, a daughter to Debo. And by extension, uh, a granddaughter of Arma. Uh, through Debo, of course. Uh, she's uh, 14 months now. Uh, she is still uh, yet to be bred and she'll be bred maybe in another four months, in another four months. Eh? She's a lovely female. Her brothers are huge, huge. They're bigger than Debo now. And uh, yeah, we always look forward to better productions. Now this lady over here is our lady from uh, Romania. Uh, she's a huge, huge female, very tall, very thick. We usually have to regulate her weight. Uh, she gets huge. She, uh, people usually think she's a, she's a male, eh? a smaller male. Uh, she's uh, a bit older. She's now about five years. Uh, she's a lovely lady. Uh, right here, uh, we've got a piebald female. Uh, I think you met her during our last, uh, our last uh, video. Uh, she was there. Maybe you can refer to that video. You are introduced to Rosa here. She's our import from Moscow. Uh, she's the hypoallergenic female. Uh, but we'll get this fixed uh, soon. We already, we already got uh, the vets on hand. And uh, she's a lovely female. She hurts herself hitting uh, her head on this uh, rail. She's a bit aggressive, but uh, you know, uh, the nature of dogs sometimes. Eh? We have uh, a meshed kennel here. We've got a very aggressive male at the very end. So that kennel is a bit uh, big and uh, he's a tough guy. Eh? Uh, right over here we've got uh, Isabella. Isabella is a female uh, uh, from uh, of the lines of Romania. She's not... Bella, Bella, come, come. Bella, hey, Bella, come, 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 this way. Now, now Isabella is a tough, aggressive female, eh? uh, a bit gentle at times, but uh, I like her so much because of the coat color. Uh, she's got a beautiful head type. She's daughter of a famous male. She's daughter of uh, Samosveti Sibiri Pharaoh, uh, a huge, huge male, very thick. Uh, the male was not so tall. You can uh, attest to also the height of the female. She is uh, black. That is a lovely color. We we took her for the set of genetics. Eh? She's never had a female as short as she is. Uh, her males are huge. Eh? Uh, then this is uh, our boy Neto. Uh, Neto is uh, a son of Basman from an outside female. Uh, Neto was born alone. This was a singleton. This was a singleton litter. Uh, he's a lovely boy. Uh, yeah, uh, Basman hasn't had many litters, but uh, yeah, he's uh, he's a good one. Uh, um, we have hope in him. We can. Uh, we are planning to retain him for the breeding uh, litter. Uh, we've got Alma here. Uh, let us wait. Arma, Arma, come, come. Arma, come, come, come. She's a bit defiant, eh? Uh, but you'll see her in the other videos. Arma is our grey wolf, grey female. Uh, she's uh, a nice, nice female. A credible producer. She's produced well before. She's the mother to Debo. As you may recall from our other video, Debo was the male uh, in our other video that had a cone. The ones that uh, were affected uh, by Chiri Eye. There is Arma. She's uh, interesting. She has shed coat because she was coming to heat. She's been served presently to Basman. Uh, Basman is our boy from Russia. Uh, our brindle. Uh, our brindle male. 
So you can see him right beside the armor. Uh, he's a tall, tall boy. Uh, he's a heavy, heavy boy. Uh, doesn't look too heavy, but he's huge. I think he's around somewhere in the 90 years. Uh, but we try to regulate his uh, we try to regulate his weight gain so that he is able to comfortably breed. Uh, um, he's now around two and a half years. Uh, yeah, uh, prime breeding age. While Arma is around four years. Uh, yeah. So on this other side, we've got. Uh, We've got Debo. Hey, boy, boy, boy. Debo, Debo. Chop, 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 chop. Up, up, boy. Let him, let him move a bit so that I can. <laughs> so you see, the big boy is just a big puppy. Debo, come, come, boy. Hey, Debo, Debo. Come. So Debo is a giant. He's a male we retained from uh, that litter. Uh, he's just a big baby. He's around two years and something now, two years and a couple of months. Uh, he has produced and uh, he has, he's a very credible producer so far. Uh, we've had outside uh, puppies born uh, uh, outside uh, for, the, uh, for the stud services we've, we've given. But uh, even here in the kennel, he's produced well. He's a huge, huge boy. Big head, big coat and uh, a lovely personality. Uh, yeah. We hope to have his litter soon also. He's being uh, bred to Rosa. Rosa is the girl from Moscow. Now here we've got, uh, uh, my sister calls this one Munchkin, but uh, her name is Koki. She's uh, a female I returned to my kennel uh, 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 from a previous breeding. Um, I had a male that I kept uh, for a while, then sold. That male uh, was bred to another import, and uh, by consequence, uh, I retained one uh, from that litter, a friend's litter. And uh, she's a lovely girl, great prospect, great, great parents, very large size. She's now gaining height. She might look a little bit lean, but uh, she's a giant of a girl. She'll be a proper, proper producer someday. If we move uh, all the way to the very end, uh, over here we've got two maternity sections. Uh, the puppies are laying way over there. There are three. I'll, I think I'll carry one for you to see. Uh, they are uh, just turning three weeks uh, on Wednesday. Uh, they are still quite young, but uh, they are puppies of uh, good descent. Uh, as I told you before, we select from a great gene pool, so that uh, the gene pool that we also provide is also great. Um, and it is always a great opportunity to meet puppies. Sometimes we also get, uh, just as people get baby fever, we also get puppy fever. Sometimes you stay for so long without getting pup 